So there's one song that you shared with me last night and there's one song that I shared with you last night. <laughs> and I wasn't able to sleep because of this song. I kept on listening to it. Um you have heard it I think once or twice as well. So this is just one of my recent favorites, I must admit. And the band as, as well. The band I have become fan. I've followed them everywhere now. So <laughs> I love their work. So let's so, I think let's jump jump into it right away and then discuss it later. Let's do it. Let's do it. Three, two, one, play. Beautiful use of electronic guitars here. Amazing use. electronic guitar the, the, the drums The guitar in the back. The use of electronic guitar in this track is amazing. It's beautiful. <sighs> okay, I'm 
officially the fanboy of level five. <laughs> <laughs> I'll promote the music, share it everywhere, share with everyone. <laughs> I just, I just love their work. I, I knew that. Uh, I knew when the, the first time I heard '60s Love that you're gonna love it. This is your kind of music. This is my kind of music, man. So it's not like it's not. I didn't love it. I didn't like it. '60s Love is one of those tracks that I'm, I'm listening like every single day, and mm. if I don't have time to jam in that track amongst other, I wanna s- listen the new ones. Mm. I cut my sleep short. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, that's sure. the only solution, right? Yeah. That's the only solution. I'm sleep deprived because of level five. So, yeah, but that's not on you. That's not on level five, guys. <laughs> You're doing a amazing job. Well, um, they are. They are. I mean. I, so, I mean, I'm coming from 60s love. <clears throat> um, yeah, coming from 60s love, it's this song i don't know the narrative i don't remember the i mean i'd have haven't gone through the lyrics yet mm-hmm. but i can talk about the music itself i i would wait for your um narrative uh description mm-hmm. but the electronic guitars and drums Oof, this was drums. All, but also i when i want to mention that the simplicity in this track yeah. was i mean the simplicity was a beauty i think this is a theme with level five they, this is, they, this is the they bank on simplicity they bank on being less is more exactly right exactly. and then that that uh, they make beautiful melodies beautiful sounds out of it but you go yeah so i i got hold of the lyrics from their youtube video uh, it was in um uh, i translated it from google translate and <clears throat> obviously it can never do justice to the actual lyrics and I understood the overall idea. The lyrics were pretty much simple, um, but that did not matter for me, honestly, because I was so hypnotized by their music that I did not care how deep the lyrics were. And I mean, I don't know what is with level five and their nostalgic music for me. Their music always transport me back to the past days and brings a smile and tear at the same time. You, You kept telling me, so viewers, he kept telling me uh, when I sh- when he shared the song with me that this takes me back to our university days. So we yeah. know each other from like from childhood. 14, uh, 14 yeah. 15 years now. Yeah. So he, he kept telling me that it, this takes us to the university, those beautiful university beautiful days when days. we were students. And uh, that was one of the best times of our lives. <clears throat> Seriously. Most, I mean, most joyful, most beautiful time of our life. Right. And th- this is this is where we used to like sit down in our university you know, corridors and sing along exactly. and, and bring guitar and play guitar. I I used to play guitar back then. Yeah. And uh, yeah. since then it, it has kind of waned off. But uh, yeah, exactly. It takes you back to those days. Exactly. For me as well. Exactly. Just imagine driving alongside the beach and listening to this song. Right. We used to do that. that. We used to do that. I mean, we used to have night outs. <laughs> considering that we are studying but we used to, we, not. Used, <laughs> <laughs> we used to take long long drives to the beach yeah. staying whole night at the beach and playing this kind of music exactly. this is exactly that kind of music we used to listen to but this I mean it's not like the similarity doesn't I mean ends there similarities end there this is very fresh the music is very unique the style is very different very very different and again i want to emphasize that the beauty of their work for me this is very subjective opinion for me is mm. the their simplicity agreed they don't 100%. they don't overdo drums they, exactly. they don't have unnecessary drum solos they don't have unnecessary uh, guitar solos guitar solos they, they have what's needed for the melody for the lyrics for the narrative for the, the for the emotion they are trying to convey just enough exactly, exactly. just enough exactly you were take, mentioning that they don't have any ugly drum solos or excessive drum solos and i want to point out that the use of drum symbols in the beginning yeah, yeah. and then in parts of the song was brilliant constantly exactly the constant tish 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 i think it was I also noticed that um, this, uh, if I'm not wrong, I'm, I hope I'm not wrong, but um, the the hollow guitar was missing, the acoustics 
were yeah. missing in this track um, that we noticed in the 60s love and mm -hmm. um, in, in that track <clears throat> It was extremely beautiful that they had that um, uh, hollow guitar and that that sound it makes. I mean, I personally I love it because uh, that the the the, the thrum mm -hmm. uh, of hollow guitar goes to me, touches me, or talks to me more. And it was missing, but that's not a negative for this track, right? No, no, no. This is what I'm trying to point out that this track had enough. Enough, absolutely. And, and I want to mention, um, you touched upon the guitar notes in the long song pretty well. And in this song as well, the way the notes were designed were amazingly beautiful. Another thing, the vocalist voice is hauntingly beautiful for me as well. <laughs> hauntingly beautiful. And the backing vocals in the song added a layer to that uh, created and that also created an experience. One, one, one <laughs> guilty pleasure that I would like to share. <laughs> Um, there was a movie that was recommended by you actually at the start of our university days 14 years ago and that movie was called A Walk to Remember oh, and <laughs> some, some could term that movie as a teen movie we but were it was teens, a, we were teens at that time but it was a tragic movie with a great message the message of the movie was great yeah. um, and anyways most of the songs of that movie were composed by a band called Switchfoot uh, they are not mm -hmm. really popular but there was a particular song that has stayed with me forever and it was called You this mm -hmm. song brought back memories of that particular song Moonlight, instantly. You. Yeah, yeah. Seriously. Yeah. Moonlight and you. So, <clears throat> when we heard um, 60s Love for our viewers, uh, this guy is actually an amazing singer as well. So, he, he sings really well. And he was always a singer of the of the group, and uh, you yeah. are overestimating me. <laughs> <laughs> I I really I'm pushing him like every single day to cover it. I am pushing him to every single day to cover it. The 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 mental barrier here I can see that um, I mean singing in a different language that you don't speak. Agreed. And and and, and uh, having correct pronunciations is actual is added difficulty. True. But I think someday, someday, someday. you would. And uh, I mean, I would love to hear it in your song. Maybe, maybe in future, uh, it's a fantasy that you might collaborate <laughs> with Level Five. Maybe like you, you strumming the fantasy. guitars. You you can yeah, you can do guitar strumming for sure. <laughs> so maybe someday, maybe someday we sing along with yeah. uh, on video. On That's video a fantasy. Where, yeah, there where I have guitars on and you uh, sing. Uh, on wow. top of the song but this is this is the kind of beautiful song this is that I, and again I'm again repeating myself the simplicity that you can sing along you can play along you know you can sing on top of it you can create ha harmonies or harmonies with it. and uh, this is the kind of work that level 5 is doing and um, that's why I probably I love it just the last thing that I want to mention, I want to know who basically designed the, the melody of the chorus in their song because whoever designed the chorus, it's so catchy that I kept humming it the whole day, honestly. Also, also, I th we have um, interacted a little bit with Level 5 already mm -hmm. and uh, I, would, I would also request them if they are listening, mm -hmm. can you please tell us a little bit of, about your philosophy about what yeah, is the we would love to know. Thought, process thought process behind your work behind your work like what drives you what motivates what makes you make this kind of music such music seriously we would love because to know. <laughs> there has to be i mean each group of musicians have they come from a philosophy they come from an ideology and it reflects into their mm. music right so mm. i would love to know what is it with them Seriously, it's making me charged. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> right. So I think that's it from me. That's it. That's it from my side as well. See you on the next one then. Yeah, see you on the next one. Level 5. Uh, more work from you, please. <laughs> please. <laughs> that's it. All right. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.